She named him and then brought him over, and I said, well, okay, kid, you can stay here, or I can... Sit again with her special pets. <laughs> and I gave him his choice, and in a couple of days he said, oh, I like it fine here. But he's because he's well caught, he's very sluggish right now, because of the season. Uh -huh. So I don't really bother him. This one, and she's burrowed all the way in. I don't think she's out. She started coming last night. But she's burrowed herself in, too. And this one's small compared to the other ones. Yeah, he's probably <laughs> only about three, three or four years old. Huh. But he's not the biggest. The biggest is 13 inches, dinner, yeah. dinner plate size. Yeah. And they're very fragile. They have a hard time surviving and living in captivity. Oh, hey, hon. It's okay. It's just mummy. Yeah, it's just me. Yeah, come on. Come on, it's okay, Michael. You know, I won't always bother you like this. I'll probably be afraid of you in another few months, huh? It's all right, huh? sweetie, it's just me. Okay, well, if you don't want to, it's up to you. He's gonna molt soon. And he is a he, unfortunately. Thank you, sweetie. And, I said, and they do everything extremely slow. They molt, the tropicals molt like once, like three times a year. Uh huh. Because they grow quickly and don't live as long. And these desert species, they molt once every three years. Hey, Rosebud. Hey. Hi, sweetie. Come on. He's he's really my uh, he's my buddy. And he um he knows the sound of my voice. Hey, what's up? Oh, he probably feels your energy. Mm -hmm. So this is Rosebud. He's a mature male. You see the hook? Whoa, gosh, that guy. What, you're so jumpy today. What's your story? You want to stay out, won't you? Can you see the hook on his front leg? Oh, I think so. He's oh, yeah, I yeah. see it. Uh -huh. That that shows that he's a mature male. Uh -huh. And when they grow those, they uh -huh. use them to hold the female's fangs away when they mate. Oh, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> this is Olga. True tarantulas. Hmm? Tube. Tube. Tube webs. Oh. Hey, Jet. How are you doing? And these guys are beautiful. They just molted out of their juvenile likes the camera. color. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Jeff. There's another one sleeping back over there. Yeah. The females collect the sperm in little sacks, uh -huh. and then they get to choose if they want to lay eggs or not. Wow. If they don't want to, they molt. Most of the women I say that too go, wow, that's pretty cool. <laughs> they get to choose, huh? You know, he's a bit afraid of your energy. Really? Just because you're new, I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah, but he's my, he's my little champion. Yeah. They're still asleep. Hey, sweetheart. Yeah. And then see his, uh, well, you can't really tell with him, but his pedipalps, the short appendages here, mm -hmm. they get real big on the ends. Yeah. And then they get so big on the ends that they can't molt because they can't pull that body part out. No. Once in a while, the mature male, Rosie, will um, drop his palps and live on without so them. He's got ten appendages. That's right. right. And one appendage is missing a foot. He lost a foot a few months ago in the back. Oh, so it's just a foot part. Huh? Yeah. Oh, I see. So yeah, there's a little segment missing. I panicked, put super glue all over it. Did you? Which is what you do to <laughs> stop him from bleeding. Oh. But he uh, took half a day and picked it off, oh. and he was fine. I see. Yeah. He loves to go and walk about, and I just recently lost him for three days. Did you? Yeah, he was under the stove in the apartment. 